The new Dallas city manager says it may take three to four months to find a new police chief. T.C. Broadnax, who takes over as Dallas city manager next month, will inherit a number of challenges, including finding replacement for former chief David Brown, the mess we've been reporting on for the Dallas Police and Fire Pension Fund, and crumbling streets. Fox 4's Lori Brown live at Dallas City Hall tonight with more. Lori. Steve, finding a successor to retired police chief David Brown will be tough, but it may be the easiest job that T.C. Broadnax has when he takes over here at Dallas City Hall next month. Are you ready? I am ready. T.C. Broadnax is still about a month away from taking over as Dallas City Manager, but already he has a timeline for picking a new police chief. Will you look within the department or outside? I think all options are on the table. Hopefully we'll cast a, a wide net. Uh, get a lot of interested uh, people uh, in the job. It's a very important position. That process hopefully will take about three to four months uh, and we'll be able to find uh, the best police chief uh, in the country. Broadnax says he plans to meet with leaders from the Dallas Police Unions once he moves into his job full time. He did not always see eye to eye with leaders at the Tacoma Police Union. The president of the Tacoma Police Union says that you downsized an already depleted department causing a spike in crime. Can you explain why? Well, first and foremost, um, when I got to Tacoma, uh, we were experiencing uh, significant budget challenges. Uh, and be it that police and fire made up approximately 65% of our budget, uh, there were not a lot of options. We began to add back resources in the police department this year, and we'll, they'll continue to do that going forward uh, as the financial situation continues to improve. Broadnex is aware that the city is postponing a bond that would help fix streets, but he says he is no stranger to budget challenges. I think we got to look annually at our maintenance budgets, and I've got to spend some time uh, with staff uh, truly understanding the budget. But again, we've had the same issues in Tacoma, uh, the same issues in San Antonio, the same issues in Florida. So streets uh, are notoriously uh, a uh, pinch point. Broadnax, who will be earning $375,000 in his first year, comes to Dallas at a time when the mayor has publicly stated that problems with the Dallas Police and Fire Pension Fund threaten to bankrupt the city. Is bankruptcy a possibility for the city of Dallas? Well, I'm probably not the one uh, to ask uh, that question at this point in time. I need to spend more time uh, with the mayor, council, as well as our finance staff. Uh, I wouldn't uh, cast a dark shadow. Uh, and think that that was going to uh, rule the day, I think we'll be fine. Uh, we just need to all sit around the table and get going on finding solutions. Even though Broadnax does not officially start his job here at City Hall until next month, he is already splitting his time between here and Tacoma. Steve.